Hello. Okay. This video will cover tracing items like flat drawings, etc., or even some 3D items directly into Lightburn or any programs you may have that will accept input directly from a webcam and allow you to trace the item directly into that program. A bit like using a photocopier, except, like I've said, you can also trace non flat objects. For this simple demonstration, I'm going to trace directly into Lightburn. A simple drawing, actually an illustration from a lawnmower instruction manual. I will be using for this a simple smartphone that was past its best days and I had discarded for an updated phone. You can of course just use the one you have now. I posted a video on my channel a while back on how to turn a phone into a wireless fully portable webcam totally free and in just a few minutes. You may want to check that video out first if you've not done so yet. But for now I will assume you have and carry on. OK, here is the phone on which I have the app needed for it to transmit to the computer. And on the computer I have the corresponding app to receive it and tell the computer the feed is a webcam. So after they are both started, we will start up Lightburn and in the Lightburn camera section choose the Irian webcam as our camera source. Once you're happy, click Trace in Lightburn. You will be presented with the tracing screen with the item ready to be traced. Whichever method you find gives you a nice trace, you'd use that. But I find in this case, sketch trace does the best job for me. I draw a box around the item I want to trace. This keeps anything that you don't want to be included in the trace out of the picture, so to speak. I mess around with the slider until I get what I think's right, and then I finish the job. Now often you will end up with this black square in Lightburn. I just click to ungroup the whole thing, click away somewhere and then back onto the black area and drag it away and delete it. Regrouping here just in case when I move it around I lose parts of the drawn. I will now preview the result. You can save this as a project, an art file or just send the traced image to be burned and that's all there is to it if this video has been of any use to you please like and subscribe this will encourage me to make more of these tips and i have a lot of them until next time bye for now